Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. So today I want to make a Red Dead Online video and today is a top 5 video where I want to talk about top 5 glitches that need to be patched in this game and I didn't want to have to make this video because I figured that you know a lot of these glitches would be fixed but as I'm speaking right now and as this video has been uploaded and recorded these glitches are all still in the game and they're pretty annoying and these are glitches that just ruin gameplay experience and frustrate a lot of people and a lot of people want this stuff fixed. I personally enjoy Red Dead Online. I think it's an awesome game and I really want this stuff fixed and if you agree with me, you think this stuff should be fixed as soon as possible, I guess send this video to Rockstar's feedback page and I know some people are going to be saying oh Red Dead Online is broken and all this other stuff. The game works fine. There's just some annoying glitches that should be taken care of and GT Online also has plenty bugs. But anyways, let's get started with this video. Starting off at number 5, we have the horse freezing glitch. And this glitch can be really annoying, especially when you're trying to get somewhere pretty quickly. You get off your horse, you pick something up like a collectible, you get right back on the horse, and the horse pretty much freezes in place. The horse will not move, and even when other players get on the horse, your own horse, they'll be able to move it, but you can't yourself. And to fix this glitch, you can call your horse away and then call it in, but then you gotta wait a few minutes. You can also join a new lobby, but this is very frustrating it's just really annoying and this is a perfect example of this my horse was freezing me and my friend were getting collectibles here and my horse just kept getting stuck it wouldn't move and my friend actually ended up transporting me a bunch of times this actually happens multiple times as you can see right here happened another time also happens a third time horse just gets stuck frozen in place and will not move pretty annoying Again, you can find a new lobby to fix this glitch, and you can also call the horse away and then call it in, but still, this shouldn't be happening, and it's just very frustrating when it does. Next at number 4, we have disconnected from Rockstar servers. And this has been going on since the game first came out, this has been an issue for some time, but this became an even greater issue, especially with the trader business. And this is actually from my review, when I reviewed the Frontiers Pursuits DLC, and look at what happened to my friend here. I was helping her sell her full camp. She was selling 100 goods, and then she randomly got disconnected. And after she got disconnected, she lost everything. She actually sent me this screenshot, which actually shows her losing everything here. Produced two goods, but that was because she just got back on the game, loaded in, and she lost pretty much everything. So she had to start all over again. This random disconnection, this can be really annoying because you can be in the middle of something, you could be picking up collectibles, you could be in the middle of a bounty hunt mission, and worst case scenario, you could be in the middle of a trader business. And Rockstar actually patched a trader business where if you try to close your app, it will actually get deleted. But the thing is though, the game does not differentiate between closing your app and between getting disconnected. So if you get disconnected, even if it's not your fault, even if you have a great internet connection, if it's completely on Rockstar servers, you are gonna pay the price and you are gonna lose all your goods. This needs to be changed. And you know, I understand it's not easy to change servers. I get that, but people should not be losing all 100 goods because they randomly get disconnected. That's not fair. At number 3, we have the Moonshine Black Screen Glitch. And to be fair to Rockstar, they have actually hotfixed a lot of stuff with the Moonshine business. The Moonshine business was really glitchy at launch, and they have fixed some of the issues, but some issues still remain. One really annoying issue was that in the past, if you actually tried to join somebody else's posse, your Moonshine shipment could actually be deleted. Rockstar has hotfixed that and, and fixed that for the most part, but on the other hand, there's still the annoying black screen glitch. And the black screen glitch happens just like this. This happened to me a few days ago. You talk to Marcel, you try to sell your moonshine business, and when you start selling your moonshine business, the screen goes black and is then stuck on this black screen right here. And you're stuck on this endless black screen, it will never load. I actually waited around 10 minutes just to see if it would load, it did not load. And to be fair, you can get around this by trying to join another friend. If you try to join a friend from your friends, let's hit join session and then you hit cancel, you can actually get out of this. I did this on one of my live streams to get out of this because it got stuck there, but at the same time it's still really annoying when you're trying to sell your business and you just get put in this endless black screen Screen really needs to be fixed as soon as possible. Moving on to number two, we have the animal spawns. 
And a lot of people have been really upset about this. This has been broken for some time since the Frontiers Pursuit update back in September. And ever since the animal spawns have just gotten really bad, I've pretty much given up on doing the trader business because you need to be able to hunt to do the trader business. And I just do the moonshine business, I do the collector and the bounty hunter now, and this is a perfect example of the animal spawns being really bad. I remember, like many months ago, when you could go to the Great Plains and Blackwater, you could find plenty of stuff here, you could find plenty of deer in these plains, you could find buffalo, bison I should say, but you can't find anything here. You can see me just riding around here. I'm going through these big open plains, I don't see anything. I do see a few birds, don't get me wrong, but there's nothing else here. Nothing. Just riding around here. No animal spawns. I don't know why the animal spawns have gotten like this. Just animals are just not spawning like they used to. I'm not the only person that feels about feels this way about this. A lot of people are upset about the animal spawns. And even if we go north of San Denis, that place, a lot of people were hunting at place. That place had a lot of good birds to get, a lot of boars, and had alligators all over the place. But now whenever I go up north of San Denis, I can't find any alligators. Alligators are the most common animals. They were all over the place. But there's no alligators. And to be fair, you can fix the animal spawns by going into a legendary bounty. Plenty of people tell me, oh, go into a legendary bounty and the animal spawns will fix themselves. Also, if you find like a solo public lobby, animal spawns will also fix them, fix themselves and animals will start spawning. So I'm guessing it has something to do with the server and the amount of people in in the game ever since the Frontiers Pursuits update. But the, at the same time is, I shouldn't have to go into a legendary bounty just to be able to hunt animals. The animals should be spawning regardless if I'm in a legendary bounty or not, and regardless of the amount of people, animals should be spawning. They should definitely be spawning around the place, so hopefully the next update, Rockstar addresses this and finally fixes the animal spawns because a lot of players that hunt have been getting really annoyed by this. And number one, the number one glitch that I think should be patched and is upsetting the most amount of players is the camp glitch. Yup, that's right. You play Red Dead Online, you've probably encountered the camp glitch, and the camp glitch is basically where your camp won't spawn. You try to choose the location, and it won't spawn. And in this case, it's actually working perfectly. This is how camp should spawn. You choose a location, it spawns there, no problem. Oftentimes, though, you go into the little interaction menu here, you try to spawn your camp, camp won't spawn. Camp will act, the thing will actually go gray for a little bit and the camp will not spawn. You gotta find a new session oftentimes, then sometimes you get stuck trying to find a new session. It can just be really, really annoying. But the camp glitch does not just go as far as the camp spotting. There's other glitches as well. Take a look at this for instance. In this case, I was trying to do a resupply mission with Crips. I needed to get supplies for my trader business. I talked to him, it finishes talking to him, finishes the little cutscene where he's talking, and guess what? No mission started. I talked to him a second time, try to get the mission started. Also does not work. Talk to him, see the cutscene, mission does not start. So the camp can be really buggy at times. And to be fair to Rockstar, ever since the Moonshine update, they have reduced the amount of camp glitches. It has gone down severely because I remember before the Moonshine update, it was really, really bad. Like almost every lobby you would join, you would be getting tons of the camp glitch, but it still does happen and it's still annoying. And the reason I put this as number one on my list is because the animal spawns, at least those you can deal with, you can go to places in the map that not a lot of people are in, like in Coulter, find some deer there, or go into a legendary bounty at Hunt. But regardless of how much you hunt, you can't bring that back to camp if your camp can't spawn. So it makes it really difficult to be able to run the trader business. And that is pretty much my list there, guys, of the glitches that I think should be fixed in Red Dead Online. Did I miss any? I'm sure I've missed some other glitches, but these are glitches that personally have annoyed me when I've played through the game. And this, is, this isn't this is me hating on Red Dead Online. I love Red Dead Online. It's one of my favorite games, but I just want some of these issues fixed. GTA Online also has a fair share of glitches. I did videos on glitches on GTA, so I figured I'd do one on Red Dead. But I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think of this. Do you think Rockstar is going to fix this stuff? And again, if you agree with me and you think that Rockstar should fix this stuff as soon as possible then send this to them on their rockstar feedback page i'm sure eventually they'll take a look at it hopefully they will but i hope that you guys enjoyed the video if you did drop a like and if you're new to my channel enjoy my content subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one take care everyone